Hello, my name is Bailey. I am a 16 year old girl from Florida and um, please don't stalk me, but the point is, is that I'm making this uh, makeup tutorial to um, basically cover your eye with makeup. I'm stupid. <laughs> Anyways, the point is, is that this makeup tutorial is for if you wake up late for school and you're just like, oh, I'm so tired, I don't feel like doing any makeup or um, I want to do makeup but I don't have time and I just want to look awake and glowing. So basically this is the look we're going to be doing. You see it? It's right there. Anyways, um, I don't have a voiceover so this is going to be an awkward video. So anyways, um, what we're going to be using is a highlighter stick. It's supposed to be for your cheeks but I think it's really good for the eyes. Um, it won't hurt your eyes but anyways, uh, first what you'll need to do is prime your eyes. I use... Uh, Mary Kay Eye Primer. It's upside down. <laughs> ah. Anyways, it's really good because priming your eyes makes eyeshadow stand out more, and so if you sweat, it won't, like, make your eyeshadow run or just come off easy. So, prime your eyes. <laughs> anyway, so what we're going to do with this highlighter stick is, you see it? Yep, there it is. You're going to take your ring finger. So, just matter what hand, just make sure it's a ring finger. And, um, you're going to rub it all over your finger. Yeah, that's what you're going to do. And then, um, you're going to rub it all over your eye. So, it doesn't matter where you start. It doesn't matter as it's all over your eye. The sun in my face. So, I'm doing this, like, right next to my window. So, the light keeps changing. Anyways, we're going to need a lot of it. So, make sure you go in the corner of your eye. I have to burp, but that would be weird. There we go. Excuse me. <laughs> Awkward. Um, a little bit more. And we're going to go under the eye now. But make sure when you put makeup under your eye with a brush or, like, take makeup off or anything, make sure you go in with your eye. So, like, like that. Never go out like that because it will give you, uh, wrinkles. And you'll grow up and be like, man, I should have listened to Bailey. But, you know, simple as that. So, we're all done with that. So, now what we're going to do is use this glam shadow stick. I don't even know. But it's, like, kind of like the, um highlighter but a little bit darker and a thinner stick as you can see like anyways um it's a really good glam stick I got it from Sephora all these stuff is from Sephora like the eyeshadow I mean not, not the eyeshadow the eye uh whatever that is that is all from uh Sephora I love Sephora but these are all gifts gifts um so, I'm not a rich person. So, yes. Anyways, this is I sh la, 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 really bad at this. This is I, um, I'm just going to restart this video. No. No, I won't. Ugh, I'm so tired. Anyways. <laughs> so embarrassing. This is eyeliner. There we go. Good job, Bailey. And this is eye mascara. No one says eye mascara. It's mascara. Okay? So, yep. Let's finish on. We're going to take this darker shade, it's like a champagne copper color, and we're not going to put it like close to the inner part of our eye. We're going to just go like that. It's really simple. Dude, my baby cousin could do this. It's so simple. And then we're going to go under our eyes. Why did I just do that? <laughs> I'm a weird person. So anyways, um, since it's like a gel shadow, we're going to rub it in. So again, use your ring finger. Um, you don't have to take off the eyeshadow from the ring finger because it's just it's the same color, really. Just a lighter. It's, you don't have to. Go under your eye. Make sure you go in. Good job. Here we go. Gotta close it. And now we're going to do shake it up. It's just going to be a thin eyeliner, so bear with me. Why is nothing coming out? That's weird. This is really weird. It's not coming out. Still working? Nope, I think it's all dried up. Figures. Anyway.
Um, yeah, so that is that. It's not coming out, so we're just going to leave it like that. Halfway done, but that's okay. Now we're going to do mascara, so yay. Gotta, you know how to put mascara on, so be simple. It's really awkward watching people put mascara on, but, you know, I'm going to regret uploading this video. Everyone probably knows how to put makeup on, but, you know, I've always wanted to do this. I'm doing it. I just put that on. Oh my god, I'm going to start crying. This sucks. Yep, there's a tear coming out of my eye as we speak. Or I speak. I'm just really bad at this, aren't I? Mm -hmm. Anyways, there it is. Simple as that. Um, literally took me like five minutes. So technically six so far. Anyways, we're gonna take a big fluffy brush, as you see here, and we're gonna put it in. Um, I don't want to show you what um, blush I'm using because it's just from like an old uh, makeup kit and I haven't been able to go get some so I had to dig in my makeup drawer and find a crappy stuff. I'm just gonna show you look at like oh so gross. Anyways, um we're gonna use <laughs> so weird. We're gonna be using both of them. They're right there. So if you can't see that's blush. Yeah. So we're gonna mix it in. It's a lot. So Tip off the excess. It's gonna be really pink, but I will smile. <laughs> there we go. Um, do it again. Tap off excess. Smile. Oh, it just burped. That was gross. Anyways, that's your look, really. Oh my god, I suck at this. Anyways, <laughs> if you want to do this look and you don't have the gels, like, um, I don't think they're considered gels, but anyways, you don't have the glam stick or the highlighter. Why am I showing you again? You know what they are. Anyways, you don't have those things. It's cool. All you need is eyeliner and eyeshadows with the same kind of color so basically you can use like the only blue eye kit and but you don't use a metal because this is not a bold look this make your eyes look brighter and more awake and um you're going to be using like the top color for everywhere else including the corner and the shimmer uh champagne color copper color for the lid simple as that and before i forget you're going to use white eyeliner for the waterline of your eye so Simple as that. It makes your eyes look much bigger and awake. I hate putting water, like, liner on my waterline because it's really bad for your eye. But, yep. Anyways, this is your look. Or my finished look. <laughs> I'm not gonna upload this. Nope. Anyways, this is the look. Mix. My eyes look much more awake and it's pretty glam full and um I wouldn't use lipstick with this look I wouldn't even use lip gloss I just would use like tinted lip balm which I'm going to be using Nivea Kiss of Cherry yeah so whew I feel like I just got kissed in my cherry <laughs> anyways this is the finished look I hope you guys enjoy it So it's a very, very simple look. Um, yeah, so thank you for watching. Uh, please stay tuned because I'm going to be showing you guys how to um, apply foundation properly, including moisturizer and, of course, foundation and the right brushes. So please stay tuned for that. And sorry for the awkward video. It's my first one, but I've already made like seven of the same video and taken off my makeup like 12,000 times. But I finally think I got it right, even though it's horribly wrong. Enjoy. Bye.